Okay, so the aim of this is to show you how to debug uh, an example R markdown file and uh, within the project template framework. So, okay, let's have a look. So, yeah, we've got the uh, R markdown file here that uh, is not compiling. Um, and presumably we've got some data manipulation here. Um, we've got the data file in the data folder. So we're going to be trying to import this CAS file, um, do some data manipulation in the munge file, and then this should all work, right? Okay, so let's, let's see if there's any initial issues. First, uh, I'm not sure what this is doing. Um, well, I understand what it's doing. I guess there's been some confusion. The California schools data set does come from this package, but I've provided a data file, um, cas.sav. So while it is the same as the data file in this package, you're not meant to use this data file in this package. You're meant to use cas.sav. The, the rationale for that is that the exercise is meant to be like you were doing your own research and you had a data file so it's important to practice importing it and so on so we don't want any of this library AER um, stuff we don't want to be redefining CAS as CAS schools I mean it might work I don't know but okay um, second thing is uh, we probably don't want uh, any of this stuff um, any library any packages you're using um, but it might work but um, this one might cause trouble because, yeah, probably won't apply these. By having this, it's not going to apply all these steps. So I'm not sure what that would iteratively do. Um, we also don't want, yeah, this. Put all put all package labels, uh, if you can, in the config. So we'll put that here to plot two. Oops. Um, yeah, so that's that, that munch file is then looking a bit better. Um, okay, I also noticed we've got some data manipulation steps here. Not that it will necessarily not work, but um, the idea is to put all these data manipulations into the munch file. And by the looks of things, they are essentially what it's already here. And perhaps you were, yeah. So they don't need to be here. Um, that doesn't need to be there, but I know you've already got it there. So same with this one. Also, these variable declarations um, also should go in data manipulation because you want to be able to access them from anywhere. Um, so that also looks like the same as above there. Uh, I noticed when I had a quick look before, you've got a typo here, so... Um, that doesn't throw an error, so I think that's probably what would have caught you off guard, but essentially it's not an assignment, so now that should work much better. Alright, so let's, let's see at this point just whether it... Um, what happens. Okay, so yeah, this is the second time I'm going through this because the first time the audio failed, so, but basically um, they look like they were the main issues. Um, yep, okay.